thank you so much for tuning back into this video. I hope you guys have had a super wonderful <laughs>
and yes you may have some scarring in the beginning uh in the kind of like the middle like me but it'll go away i promise number one i really want to talk about like comp our confidence level level like for me there was like a point where i was so like um I don't, I don't know how to say it. like i was just so embarrassed of my skin i didn't want to leave the house but thank god that we were in a lockdown so i wasn't leaving my house anyways um every morning i would wake up with like five ginormous pimples on my face and i'm like when is this gonna end and i'm finally seeing results and seeing that my skin is starting to really show good results and not bad results um, one thing I do want to talk about though is my skin is so dry that I tried to wax my eyebrows and I put a wax strip up here and pulled it off and a whole, like I want to say a whole two layers of my skin like ripped off. So I had this really bad scar up here. So now I can't, um, I don't know if I'm trying to get in close here, but I cannot wax my eyebrows and they h look hideous and I tried, um, plucking them but plucking hurts so bad for me i don't know why i hate it so now i'm just gonna have some gorillas on my face because i can't wax my eyebrows and i don't want to pluck them because it hurts getting back into the talk about acne and how people feel i just like i would say overall it's a really rough process and especially if you um get a lot of side effects like me i got really bad back pain but thank god it is um gone and i don't feel any more back pain anymore <laughs> i'm for sure seeing a light um at the end of the tunnel and also sorry about my costume today those are kind of like fashion fans so don't mind that it kind of looks a little messy but who cares i am absolutely loving the results i have noticed that a whole bunch of blackheads i've literally like i don't know where they went but they're like gone i have no blackheads on my nose anymore um i'm starting to get like a really clear forehead and even kind of like over here and even on this side like it's starting to be really 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 clear it's kind of just like my cheek area and then i'll be good when that goes away <laughs> My lips are still severely dry and super, super, super like annoying because the minute that this Vaseline goes off my lips, I'm like, where's the Vaseline? Because I cannot stand dry lips. And when I wake up in the morning, obviously it's gone because, you know, I'm sleeping and whatever, rubbing on the pillow or whatever. My lips literally have like this clear coat of plastic on them. And I don't even know how to explain it, but it feels like someone poured super glue all over my lips and like it when i like bend them and stuff it looks like i have botox in my lips right now it doesn't look like that because i have vaseline like absorbed into my lips right now but in the morning it literally looks like i have botox like heavy 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 botox happy pride month to anyone that's in the lgbt plus community um i hope you guys had a wonderful month in toronto they have canceled the pride parade which is super sad but i believe that in america that they are still having it which is super awesome um but yeah i this is sadly where the video is gonna end more videos are gonna be coming up super 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 recently because i'm going on vacation so there's gonna be a lot of fun vlogs um kind of like get ready with me videos um so yeah go ahead and like subscribe and comment and i'll see you in my next video